Okay, this is a short little video. I thought this was great. Um, this is my jet lathe, and I always I've been trying. I've been going crazy looking for the hand wheel that goes on the other side here, and uh, I don't know. I'm just I obsess about trivial things like this. You don't really need the hand wheel. You can always just turn it by hand over here. But I don't know. I just always wanted the hand wheel, and um, so a buddy of mine in town. You know, because I was going crazy, because this is a uh, left-handed thread, half inch diameter, 12 uh, threads per inch, which turns out is like this thing called British Standard Whitmore, which I've never heard of, but you know, you learn things as you search for things like this. So anyway, I had a buddy of mine who has a machine shop in his house. He can pretty much do anything with metal. And he machined this for me out of a half inch uh, you know bar of aluminum he actually cut these threads by hand on a lathe and they fit perfect and I made this I turned this wheel myself oh, my little copper spacer fell off but I'll put that back on but anyway I, I made this I made the wheel myself I originally tried a lawnmower wheel from uh, Harbor Freight and when I, I when I spun it fast the rubber nearly flew off so I ditched that and I, I turned this out of a chunk of cedar that I had and I think it came out pretty neat and it fits in here nice and you know what let me find that copper spacer hold on it just fell off oh there it is right there let me grab that okay and let me put that back on there it's on there nice like that and I needed that spacer because uh, when you thread this into there it would go right up against the body of the lathe so that uh, didn't work out oh and I didn't have a cotter pin laying around so I just used a finishing nail I drilled right through and right through the shaft itself as well uh, so I'll probably eventually I'll replace that with an actual cotter pin because that might not be good I bent the tip of the nail so it won't come out once I get that really tight into those threads I'll be able to turn it in either direction without loosening it but um, yeah looks really good um, I'm not sure if he'd do any more for anybody else but I don't know maybe I could always ask him and see what he would want for just a little shaft and you can turn your own hand wheel you know if you happen to have a, a jet lathe like this that takes that same thread uh, anyway I just thought I'd share that and that's about it. Okay, take care of people. Thanks. Bye.